name is Josephine. And I'm Sam. And today we are here at Laza restaurant, downtown Guelph. My name is Melvin Gabagistos. I am from Guelph. Uh, I have been running this business since 2009. I started at farmer's market level. Now I have my own outlet at 74 Ontario Street by the board. All these drinks, six flavors of variety of drinks. Five of them are hibiscus with different kinds of flavors. And one of them is lemonana, it's lemon, mint and honey. The drinks are becoming very popular so far, including uh, Wolf and Kitchener. We distribute for seven stores. It's a very healthy drink. No preservative, no sugar added. Hibiscus is known to be high in antioxidant. It's more antioxidant than green tea and it lowers uh, blood pressure and it's very refreshing drink. I came by the other day to get some hibiscus tea because I'm diabetic and it's very, very healthy and um, it has no sugar so I can have a nice cold drink and it doesn't have to be a bomb. I wouldn't really say uh, the drinks are uh, it's not an ethnic drink. Hibiscus is grown all over uh, in a tropical, most tropical countries. So because of the health uh, benefits, um, a, big, uh, a big group of people from different countries are really consuming it. No, I, the only time I tried it or I tasted it was from her. Uh, maybe a year ago, I took some samples. Uh, but I haven't seen it somewhere else. At the market every Saturday, I am ready to eat my ethnic food, variety of uh, meats, gluten free, and vegetarian options. We have baked uh, foods, we have uh, drinks, and we do serve lunch as well. Today, we are serving beef and potato, split curry, rice. Mixed vegetable and salad. We have a choice of vegetarian, vegan, and gluten free option. So, yes, there is refreshments here. There is banana muffins. This is our traditional bread, basha, coffee, tea. Oh, thank you so much. Wonderful, thank you. Thank you. This, this is injera. It's a flat, uh, it's a fermented bread. Spongy, yes. it's our um, mm. ethnic bread. And gerardo has to be fermented at least for 8 hours. So we start preparing it yesterday and then we get it today. It's bubbly and it's soft and sour and it rips easily and it tastes good and it feels good. Oh, it's a lot healthy. All of that. Oh, wonderful. It's a unique flavor and it has a nice little tang to it. Fabulous texture. It's kind of odd and weird, but delicious. Mm. When we bought our house, our celebration of our house. Oh. One of the best things about people coming to Canada is they bring their culture with them, and that includes great foods. For me, it's been the iced tea. I've been following her around town for years, and uh, it's, uh, there's no preservatives, and it's very different flavors, something that you can't get in the larger grocery stores. About 10 years ago or so, I was living in Ottawa and uh, I had some friends and they really liked Ethiopian food and I was a little bit skeptical at first because you know, that's not the first thing you think about is Ethiopian cuisine, but then I went and tried it and ever since that it's been one of my favorite ethnic cuisines and I found out this place existed in Guelph and it kind of made my day and so we come here every now and then just when I need to fix my Ethiopian food and I really like it and I've gotten Ashley to like it, so if you've never tried it, I highly recommend it. 